Hey guys, okay, this is video, okay, this is video 4, coronavirus is video 1, um, intro, why we need LCM video 2, concept, oh, the prime factorization and regular LCM model video 3, this is, okay, yeah, by the time we finish this, uh, you guys will have no phone memory, <laughs> head down to Radio Shack, head down to computer stores, head down to Diamond Systems, be like, guys, I want 128 gig memory card, because if we continue with online videos, yeah, I, I will I will give you guys thousands of videos. I, I have no problem with doing these. This is actually kind of fun. Um, and the thing is, I the thing is, like in class, I'm I'm pretty sure we would have like um, <clears throat> Kanishka and Nathan potentially fighting. Aiden would have bring up something about Fortnite. Um, Joshua would have been asking questions and doing all of this stuff before we even tell them to go. And many many more, which I will include in all of these videos. No, I'm, I'm not gonna bust all the files. Okay, probably I will. Hard luck. Um, <laughs> so, no, but I tell you, honestly, as elite educators, we have the best, 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 best students. I, at least 10 of our students are gonna score top 100 in SEA this year. I, I might drop them. So, don't worry, I'll keep you guys informed. And this will be for the standard trees, standard fours that we have. This will be your destiny as well to come in the top 100 i'll do anything necessary for you guys to like score in the top 100 um okay so what we did we used two methods to find the lcm prime factorization and the old people method which is my method which is the one i learned in grad school many 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 hundreds of years ago um so we have the lcm as being 12. so we know the lcm is 12 we have, no, by the way, this is like super easy. As we venture forward and we do more videos, I'll show you guys how complex it could become. And it does get a little bit more complex, but once you understand the fundamentals and the basics, there is nothing you you cannot do at all, at all, at all, because it is, it is what it is. Once you go to secondary school and we you do different subjects, phys, chem, bio, and you learn about organic bases like 2,4-dinitrophenol, hydrazine, and you learn about DNA and DNA strands, those things have their hidden concepts. With these, what you see is what you get. And that's the reason why I tell students all the time, the stuff that you guys learn now in the SCA, in the SCA process, this is the, these are the things that you will learn and that you will need for the rest of your life. A lot of things in Form 1 to 5 is to test your knowledge, test your retention, test critical thinking skills, but it may not be fully applicable to real life. That is why you guys need to learn this. The, the concepts I learned in the S, in common entrance back in my day, which is what they call SEO now, those things have helped me daily. From going to Francis Fashion and they say they have 75% offer, to um, splitting the bill when you go out with friends and you buy pizza. Um, you buy pizza and you need to know hey okay um this person um bought so on uh, we have six people we bought three pizzas what would be the cost for each person so make sure and learn these things now because they will help you these things are way more valuable than learning why mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell and endoplasmic reticulum and all of those things that you all will learn when you guys start to do integrated science by us or chemistry biophys by us as well or geography with um, miss aruna who is behind the camera at the moment making sure that i'm not blurry like the video that we put on facebook last night um which i kind of did by myself but um this okay so we learned that the lcm is 12. so recap lcm phone tree is 12. However, we have two fractions, same numerator, that doesn't matter that much, different denominators. So what we do, we put 12 here. So 12 is essentially our new denominator. We are going to make these fractions, we're going to convert them. Like, you know how when a werewolf sees a full moon, no, human sees a full moon, he turns into a werewolf. Um, this is the human, and this is the werewolf right here. Oh, I'm pretty sure um, Rishi gonna ask about a zombie puppy somewhere around here, because this is usually where Rishi asks about zombie puppy. And be like, sir, where is zombie puppy? And I'll be like, Rishi, that was 12 classes ago, man. We need to have new mascots. 
but Rashid is good students. Actually, all of my students are good students. Um, <laughs> Alright, so I was going to be like, except Dimitri, but no, Dimitri is no boy. Dimitri is a good student. Dimitri is somebody that we want to pass with his school of choice as well. <laughs> you guys should see Masaruna face right now. I'm um, behind camera and she's like, what? Did you just call out Dimitri? No, Dimitri is a good student. Um, oh, Nadir, um, you still have to collect your prize. I'll give you instructions on that. Nadir was one of those students who won the prize four weeks in a row. So he got access to like the top level tier prizes, which includes, believe it or not, cell phone, wallet, those things. So um, I will message Nadir's mom um, on WhatsApp and you'll be able to collect your prize um, as soon as possible. This week was just crazy. My dad was in the hospital for almost the whole week. Here. So we have the denominator as being 12 and we have these, we have the new denominator will be 12. So what do we do is essentially this. We want to turn this into a fraction over 12. So we say, 12 divided by 4, so we actually put it here, usually we don't, but just to show you guys in great detail, so we say 12 divided by 4, so you get 1 and you get 3, so you get 3, 12 divided by 4 is 3, and then you multiply the top number by that, that the 3 that you guys get, so essentially 12 divided by 4 is 3, 3 times 1 will give you 3. Now, look how cool this is. If we take a 3 over 12 and we reduce it, we will get 1 over 4. Elementary, my dear Watson. So we, this is essentially 1 over 4, but expressed with a denominator of 12. We keep the addition sign because we're going to add it anyhow. And we have 12 divided by 3 to get 1, 4. So essentially we get 4, so we say 4 multiplied by 1, which will give us 4. So guys, look at it, this is like super awesome, um, do I have a different color marker? Okay, I do not have a different color marker, but I will get one for the next video. Oh, I'll do that after. Alright, so essentially what we have here is 1 over 4 is equivalent to, and this is why we do equivalent fractions when we do fractions, and this is equal to 3 over 12. And additionally, we have 1 over 3 is equal to 4 over 12. So guys, all we just did in that whole LCM was turn a quarter into a fraction with the denominator as 12, and we turn 1 over 3 to a fraction where the denominator is 12 as well. So essentially we have 3 over 12 plus 4 over 12. And remember, once we have the denominators as being the same, we just add the top numbers. Guys, that's it. Oh, that's 8 minutes? Okay, um, I will stop after this one. So all we do is 3 plus 4 is 7 over 12. And we could actually represent it as pizzas as well. So we would have three slices out of 12. We have four slices out of 12. And when we add it, we have seven slices out of 12. So guys, here what? Um, we want to get these videos to you guys as soon as possible because um, as the Facebook page is kind of blowing up, WhatsApp is blowing up. So the videos take a little bit of editing and then the logistics. We have to send them individually to over 100 parents. So bear with us, we're going to send this as the first tranche. Remember, every single class we do mathematics, we do ELA, and we do creative writing. So over the course of the weekend, you guys will receive all videos to every single aspect of um, the classes that we do. So you guys not missing out at all to will actually get access to potentially more information because of the fact that I could actually deliver fully to you guys without any distraction and also if students don't understand a topic let me know and I will offer like a live update so, so if, a stu if like next video will actually be some questions that we'll be assigning um, and you guys will pause the video do the questions and if students have any trouble with anyone um, I will I will do all of the solutions for you guys right so I'm gonna pause here gonna send out these videos and then we'll continue 
we're doing some questions on fractions and I'll give you guys some more information. So anyhow guys, be safe um, and remember, you guys, we want a balance. Yes, the coronavirus is a real thing. However, I, if you panic too much, um, that will be given into, into the fear. And there is a lot of things based on mass hysteria. For instance, the best example is Y2K. Back in my days, we had something called Y2K, where there was a programming bug, and they were saying that the computers weren't programmed to function after the year 1999. And they were saying planes were gonna fall out of the sky, and um, all computers will crash, and people will lose their house, and banks would crash. But the truth is that it was an example of mass hysteria. Now, COVID-19 is a real threat, but you guys know my first degree was chemistry and management. The main threat of this is that COVID-19, the virus attacks enzymes responsible for the proper function of the heart, whilst SARS, swine flu, they attack enzymes responsible for proper respiration, breathing, kidney function. So the thing is, it is bad, but once you're home, once you're safe, once you, you follow the tips that we, we gave you guys, you guys should be okay. Anyhow guys, peace out, we're gonna send these videos now.